Ever wondered why some people prefer their own company over the buzz of social gatherings? Welcome to the world of Sigma males. In a society that thrives on social interaction and norms, there exist individuals who march to the beat of their own drum. They are the Sigma males, a breed apart from the Alpha and Beta males we commonly hear about. These individuals are intriguing, to say the least. They display unique characteristics that set them apart from the crowd, thriving in solitude and preferring minimal social interaction. Sigma males are the lone wolves of our society, the ones who break away from the pack to chart their own path. They are the epitome of self-reliance and independence, often choosing to live life on their own terms. Unlike the alpha males who crave recognition and the beta males who seek approval, sigma males are content with their own company, finding solace in their solitude. Their solitary nature is not a sign of weakness or lack of social skills, but rather a choice. Sigma males are perfectly capable of social interaction, but they selectively choose when and with whom to engage. They value quality over quantity, choosing meaningful conversations over shallow small talk. These individuals are not antisocial, rather they are selectively social. They possess a deep sense of self-awareness, often resulting in introspective thoughts and actions. They are the thinkers, the philosophers, the ones who dive deep into the ocean of their thoughts, surfacing with pearls of wisdom and insight. Their preference for solitude allows them to focus on self-improvement and personal growth. They constantly seek to better themselves, not for the validation of others, but for their own satisfaction. They are the silent achievers, quietly excelling in their chosen fields without the need for applause or recognition. Sigma males are the enigmatic personalities of our society, often misunderstood and misjudged. Yet they remain unfazed, content in their solitary existence, constantly evolving and growing. Now that we've peeked into the intriguing world of Sigma males, let's delve deeper into their social behavior and interactions. Sigma males are known for their fewer social interactions, but why is that so? In the vast spectrum of human behavior, Sigma males stand out with their unique approach to social interactions. Their preference for solitude is not a sign of antisocial tendencies, but a testament to their self-sufficient nature. They relish their independence, thriving in their own company, where they can explore their thoughts, ideas, and engage in self-reflection. This solitude is not born out of loneliness, but rather, it's a choice a choice to detach from the noise of societal expectations and to focus on personal growth. Sigma males are self-reliant and self-contained. They don't seek validation from others, nor do they feel the need to be constantly surrounded by people to feel content. This self-sufficiency is deeply rooted in their belief in their own capabilities. They are confident in their ability to handle life's challenges and that self-belief often reduces their need for social interactions. Freedom is another key aspect that shapes the Sigma male's social behavior. They yearn for freedom from the constraints that societal norms often impose. They don't feel compelled to conform to the usual or expected behaviors. This desire for freedom extends to their social interactions as well. They would rather not be confined by the expectations and obligations that often come with extensive social circles. Sigma males are selective when it comes to friendships. They prefer a few close relationships over a large circle of acquaintances. They value depth in their relationships and prefer meaningful conversations over shallow, small talk. This selectiveness often results in fewer friendships, but the relationships they do have are often deep, meaningful, and long-lasting. So, it's not that Sigma males are antisocial or reclusive. They simply prioritize quality over quantity in their social interactions. They prefer solitude over forced socialization, meaningful conversations over superficial chatter, and deep connections over fleeting acquaintances. As we can see, Sigma males are not antisocial. 
they just have a different approach to social interactions. How do Sigma males' social interactions contrast with those of other personalities? Now, that's a question that piques interest. You see, the social dynamics of Sigma males are starkly different from those of their Alpha and Beta counterparts. Let's dive right in. Alphas, the ones often seen leading the pack, thrive on dominance. They are the ones who assert their presence in every social setting. They are the ones who the crowd gravitates towards. Their social interactions are fueled by their need to be in control, to lead, to be the center of attention. Then we have the betas. They are the peacekeepers, the diplomats. They thrive on approval and validation from others. Their social interactions are often about maintaining harmony and avoiding conflict. They prefer to blend in rather than stand out. They are the ones who nod along, who go with the flow, who keep the peace. Now, enter the Sigma male. These individuals are the lone wolves, the wanderers, the ones who prefer their own company. They are independent, self-sufficient, and do not seek validation from others. They don't strive to dominate or blend in. They simply exist on their own terms. Their social interactions are not about quantity, but quality. They don't surround themselves with a multitude of acquaintances. Instead, they choose to have a few close connections, those who understand their need for solitude and respect their boundaries. They are not antisocial, but selectively social. They don't seek to control or to please. They seek genuine, meaningful interactions. They don't need the spotlight or the approval of the crowd. They are content being on the sidelines, observing, understanding, learning. They are not swayed by societal norms or expectations. They live by their own rules, and they thrive in their own unique way. The Sigma male's unique approach to social interactions truly sets them apart from the crowd. They are a testament to the fact that one does not need to conform to societal expectations to thrive. They are the embodiment of independence and self-sufficiency. A Sigma male doesn't just exist in society, he creates his own. So, what have we learned about Sigma males and their social behavior? In this journey of understanding, we've delved into the intriguing world of Sigma males, a breed of men who are not antisocial, but rather selective socialites. These are individuals who carefully choose their social interactions, not out of fear or aversion, but out of a deep-seated appreciation for meaningful connections. They are the men who thrive in solitude, not because they despise company, but because they value their independence and self-sufficiency. We've also explored how Sigma males interact with the world around them. Unlike their Alpha counterparts, who are often the center of attention, Sigma males prefer to stay on the periphery. They are the observers, the thinkers, the men who are content with their own company. But don't mistake their silence for passivity. When they choose to engage, their interactions are purposeful and profound. Comparing Sigma males with other personality types, we've observed that they don't fit neatly into societal molds. They are neither the dominating alphas nor the submissive betas. They are a category of their own, the silent and independent sigmas. They are not driven by the need for external validation, but rather they seek internal satisfaction. In essence, sigma males are like deep oceans, calm on the surface, but teeming with life beneath. They are not bound by social norms and expectations. They are not antisocial. They are selectively social. They seek meaning in their interactions and are not swayed by shallow societal standards. They value their independence and are self-sufficient, finding contentment within themselves rather than in the approval of others. The Sigma male's world is a fascinating one, filled with deep thought, independence, and a unique approach to social interactions. They truly march to the beat of their own drum.